pity. Sussex's daughter being outgunned when Charlotte never fall from royal's grace hands down. Princess Charlotte is on course to inherit some pieces from Princess Diana's jewellery collection, here's why she was chosen to receive the honour over her cousin Lilibet Diana. Princess Charlotte, 6, and Lilibet Diana Mountbatten Windsor, for months, are the late Princess Diana's only granddaughters, so it seems only fair they would inherit some jewellery from the beloved Diana's collection. The two little girls have never met, but already the family heirlooms are being allocated for the young royals to treasure as they grow up. Palace insiders have said that little Charlotte will have her pick of the palace jewels, but there are a few pieces already being set aside for her. According to reports, Diana's priceless tiara will go to Charlotte when she's old enough to care for it. One of these is said to be the Spencer tiara, the very same crown worn by Lady Diana on the day of her wedding to Prince Charles on 29 July 1981. The show-stopping headpiece had been in the Spencer family for almost a century before the royal wedding, and had been worn at the weddings of her two older sisters, Lady Sarah McCorkadale and Lady Jane Fellows. The tiara was partly made out of a wedding gift given in 1919 from Lady Sarah Spencer to Lady Cynthia Hamilton, Diana's grandmother, for her marriage to Viscount Althorpe. Other jewels belonging to the Spencer family were also used. Diana opted to use the Spencer family heirloom rather than borrow one from the Queen's collection, as Meghan Markle did in 2018. According to Good to Know, palace sources say discussions are underway to secure crown, which currently resides with Diana's youngest brother Charles, 9th Earl Spencer. A source claimed, William is quite aware the Earl has daughters of his own, but the two have agreed that Diana's iconic piece belongs to her first granddaughter. The Spencer tiara was most famously worn by Princess Diana on her wedding day to Prince Charles in 1981, but she did wear it on other occasions too. While some reports have claimed the decision to give the tiara to Charlotte, rather than Lilibet, is a snub, there is a simple reason, she's older. Another royal insider told Australian magazine New Idea that Charlotte knows about the tiara through learning about her grandma Diana, and can't wait to one day try it on. They said, Lotta knows all about her granny Diana Dash after all, Diana is one of her middle names. She's also seen pictures of her wearing the tiara. Tradition dictates that brides wait until their wedding day before first wearing the piece, so Charlotte may have to wait a while before she can try on the tiara. It comes as new research suggests Charlotte could become the richest member of the royal family when she grows up. The study from Electric Ride on Cars suggests the princess will far exceed her older and younger brothers in her fortunes, potentially being worth as much as £3.6 billion, the Express reports. It is thought she has the potential to earn more than her brothers due to a so-called Kate Middleton effect. The phenomenon suggests fashion choices of the royal family can have a huge impact on fashion trends, which increases their worth. A source said, Prince, William is close with his uncle and has asked if his mother's namesake Tiara can be given to Charlotte someday. William is quite aware the Earl has daughters of his own but the two have agreed that Diana's iconic piece belongs to her first granddaughter. And little Charlotte is said to be giddy with excitement about the prospect, according to another source. They said, Lotta knows all about her granny Diana Dash after all, Diana is one of her middle names. She's also seen pictures of her wearing the tiara. Charlotte is more than aware that she's a princess, and she's already got plastic tiaras and gowns to play dress-ups in. It's very cute. The Spencer tiara, which dates back to the 18th century, has diamond encrusted shapes of tulips, scrolls, and stars. The piece is made up of several Spencer family jewels, including a wedding present to Diana's grandmother, Lady Cynthia Spencer for her marriage to Viscount Althorpe. There is no official price tag for the piece, but it's expected to be in the hundreds of thousands.